the things you hear about Saudi Arabia or the Middle East in general that you hear from the news, but obviously not everyone's like that. The biggest thing that struck me about when I first met Abdul uh, and his friends was that uh, everyone was very open and very friendly, but uh, the more that you hung out with them and the more that you got to know them, you realized that they were they build very strong and very meaningful relationships with their, their friends and family. I got uh, admitted to CSU and I came to the US on 2007, August 2007. And then I didn't go home till like 2009. After two years in 2009, in August 2009, uh, I went back home and my dad was shocked when he saw me. Like, you, you wouldn't believe him. When I walked into his room, he couldn't stand up. I'm Al Sherman. Uh, I'm from Saudi Arabia. I'm 23 years old. Um, I came to the United States in May 2006, so it's been almost uh, four and a half years. Um, I'm majoring in economy, and uh, um, I love being in the States. It's me and my, and my cousins. Well, they're not really real cousins. I would say my brothers. Uh, who are from Najran, my city? We actually have a different. Can we, we have we have a good relationship. If somebody gets in trouble, you know, we all are gonna help him. We all like we all help each other. You know, like we are connected. Actually, um, I'm glad that I have my cousins with me uh, in uh, like. Uh, a place which is far away from home. When you have cousins and uh, when you have cousins and families in a place that you, you're, it's new for you, you don't feel more homesick as you don't know anybody. You know, we listen to music and we call families back home. So and we cook Arabic uh, food. We, uh, we clean the chicken because there is like some blood in it and so if you didn't clean it, it's my, it might hurt your stomach. So that's why we should do it. When I got here, I was sick for like almost three months because my body, my system was, didn't, didn't use to like fast food. So after like six months or, or almost a year, we noticed that we can make like some Arabic food. We can get the products from King Suber. Hospitality is, hospitality is something, it's the main thing in our cultural and traditions, hospitality. And um, it's, it's something that we, we have to do because uh, that's what we learned like very long time from our, 
grandparents and you know from uh, like past generations that's what we learned you know is to hospi 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 do hospitality to people you know especially people who are from outside the country people from other different cultures because you want to show that you have a good culture and you you know you really want to help these people that because that's what that's what a human must do Uh, I think to an extent, I think the the relationships are just they're just different a little bit, but they are they're very strong and very open about their their friendships. I think one of the main things is that if you're willing to put in the time to form a real friendship with them, they'll reciprocate that. Mm -hmm.